It's been about a month since I announced a major life transition here on YouTube. I want to let you know how things are going. In this video, we're going to talk about how I'm handling a major career transition abroad here in Paris. Hey girl, hey, are you uh, a black woman who wants to solo travel or live abroad? If that sounds like you, do me a favor and hit the subscribe button or the subscribe bell. That way you won't miss any of the content updates we've got here. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button to like this video, share it with your community, and also comment below. So let's get into it. Let's talk about it. About a month ago, God, time is moving. God, time is really moving. So about a month or so, give or take, I was in the middle of, in the beginning stages of a major career transition, a major life transition. And so I announced what was happening on here on YouTube to this community. I told you that, you know, I, my tech contract ended suddenly. I announced the beginning of my full-time content creation career. I announced a, a bunch of, a few things, right? And I'm so grateful to have this community here to support me. This is, you know, exact. I, I could not have imagined it really. Um, we are now at about 218 subscribers strong. Some of the things that you all have mentioned have definitely, in the comments, have definitely spoken life into me, into me as dealing with this transition. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I really thank you so much. I have great news. I have a lot of good news to update you on this month has been I, I will definitely say this month has not been without some challenges okay i definitely had some what in <laughs> what just happened moments i had some moments where definitely i was angry child i was upset anxiety like what am i going to do i just want to thank you all for helping me to adjust my frame of mind that is what the main thing I have been focusing on, adjusting my, my viewpoint, reframing this. Um, if you if you watch some of my previous videos, you may know that I'm doing um, affirmations. I'm doing affirmations around abundance and money, doing affirmations also around being grateful. Those things have helped me tremendously, have helped my mental health tremendously. Y'all, y'all don't even know, okay? This has definitely been a stressful experience, but it is one that I've had to, again, reframe some things, reframe in my way of thinking. I am in the process of getting a black woman expat therapist. Um, I'm looking to book her services very, very soon. I didn't want just any therapist. I wanted one that would understand my uh, the challenges that come as an expat because there definitely are some different things. So definitely on the mental health end is where I am I am focusing on, I am eliminating the coulda, woulda, shouldas. I am grateful for this YouTube community. Those of you who spoke life to me in the comments, you may not have thought you did, but just to know that you guys were like, you're on the right, you know, you're on the right path. You got this, you'll figure it out. It means the world to me. Also, just the support of my family, my children. Um, I, my children have supported me financially okay y'all like my children are my children are adults but they have like they're like mom we know you want to be in Paris we're going to pay the Amex bill for you um we know you want to you know we're, we're going to help you out with this bill this month okay um they have really um just spoken life into me my children are like you know we know your your heart is in Paris we know you want to stay we support you. Don't worry about your visa. Don't worry about all this stuff. We got you. So that knowing that, that I have their support has been invaluable. My amazing partner, um, just encouraging me, um, giving me the the just the motivation and the hope when I'm in just literal literal tears, just just upset and, and not the most fun person to be around. Okay, um, just that study presence, knowing that. I know that, you know, he's got me in terms of mentally, financially, just, just, just that has meant, meant the world to me. So his unwavering support, his unwavering encouragement has been something that I am again grateful for. Um, also, I've got exciting news to announce. I am in the negotiation stages um, of an offer. 
got an offer in the UX space and the fintech space and we're negotiating now and I have tentatively accepted so I can't quite tell you all the details but we are looking now at um, whether I will be able to work here in Paris you know work for them from Paris they're a major UX design and consulting company in the US they currently have employees internationally so you guys I need y'all I need all my prayer warriors okay I need my prayer warriors and I need everybody like whether you know cross your fingers cross your toes whatever you got okay cross it okay put out some prayers that this that this particular opportunity will allow me to work here in Paris I have been busy interviewing y'all like I am grateful for it all some things I've interviewed for have gotten canceled right but it doesn't matter I've changed I've reframed my thought process I am grateful for it all I know that I am not alone in this I know that people have been looking for work for months and months so I am grateful for the opportunities no matter where they are you already know that I am doing content creation full-time this particular experience has given me the time I needed to really focus on some things and I've already said you guys I will not be caught slipping again multiple income streams here on out I think that what got me in my feelings was the fact that doing this abroad my network of support is not here in Paris necessarily my network is in the US and so I am actively doing more things I'm getting out of the house I am going to organizational events um, in terms of with uh, American expats I am working on building my community here I know that the gold is truly in your community no matter where you are so I'm focusing on building that here in Paris y'all I resigned my lease okay I have just been doing all the things in this last 30 days I, I definitely I had some moments of fear I'm not going to lie moments of anxiety moments where I was just child I was just upset okay I am grateful for the people who have helped to readjust my crown who have helped just just who have just been like I got you my home girls have just I have been running so many things by them they have you know stood by me who have they have just been like girl you got it you can do it they are things that I needed to hear I am excited about where I'm going in terms of within the UX space I just um, began a con UX consulting project a, a fairly big freelance consulting project and this is with um, with people in 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 uh, in the UK and we're working on an exciting agricultural project in the agricultural space agricultural slash fintech space I'm excited about that this is a chance to work on a project unlike any I've ever worked on so that just kicked off yesterday we had a, a kickoff meeting yesterday I'm excited y'all I'm excited to see where things are going I don't know why any of this happened right I don't know why I think now is the time for me to um it's been the time for me to have some rest and you know reflection which is definitely what I needed um maybe this was the time that I needed to sit down and figure some things out I am just grateful eternally grateful for the support of my family for the support of this YouTube community for the support of my friends everyone who has stepped in and just checked on me how are you doing today sis um, anything you need to talk about it is it's definitely been a moment right so I'm just grateful for it all I am excited to wear um, you know this community of 200 plus black women uh, solo travelers and black women who want to move abroad I'm excited to see where it's going I it's growing and I'm just grateful that this that I start had the foresight to start this before this particular challenge but I'm I'm good y'all like I'm good so I just wanted to get on here and update you for those of you who are, who may have been wondering where I am with some of my planning I am still I'm still in the lab planning some things right I'm still planning some things but I am making sure that every day I focus on being grateful I focus on um, abundance and I am manifesting those things I am affirming those things into my life no matter what the circumstances may look like let me know sis how have you handled how have you handled major uh, life changes 
let me know in the comments below. I know, like I said, I know I'm not the only one going through this. I know that collectively we're going through a thing right now. Let me know how you handled it. Let me know how you handled a layoff, a buyout, a career change, um, a move abroad, whatever. Let me know how you handled it in the comments below. If you've reached the end of this video and you have not subscribed, please do me a favor, hit the subscribe button. If you are a subscriber, please share this video, share this channel with women in your community who want to move abroad, black women who want to move abroad or solo travel. It is one of the best ways to help me as a black woman YouTube creator. I hope this update, you know, um, has been a, a good one for you. I know it's for me to be saying these things out loud. It's been like, okay, all right. I definitely was unsure of where I was going at one point. I am confident of what the future looks like. I will keep you guys posted again. Make sure, you know, again, we, we believe in this particular opportunity that I am uh, negotiating it will allow me to work in Paris. That's what we are believing. And we are believing the right opportunities are on my way that I just, I may not be able to see them right now, but we are believing that those opportunities are on their way. So, all right, you guys, I hope you have a great rest of your day. Don't forget, leave me a comment below and let me know how you handled major uh, transitions in your life. I definitely want to learn from you. All right, you guys, take care. I will talk to you later.